So CASA of East Tennessee is Court Appointed Special Advocates. We train volunteers to advocate for abused and neglected kids who are involved in the Knox County Juvenile Court System through no fault of their own. CASAs are appointed on cases where the judge or the magistrate needs an extra set of eyes and ears. Um, that can be a situation where somebody has a petition for custody in, there's been allegations of abuse or neglect against a child. Um, it can have, it can range all over the place. Um, and we can be appointed on cases where there's a guardian ad litem, there are other professionals involved, and sometimes we're appointed on cases where CASA is the only one in the room. So we are getting um, a full picture in whatever type of case we're appointed on to see if a child is at risk of harm and then to make recommendations to the court about how to get them out of that situation. When there is a CASA on a case, the court knows more about what's going on in a child's life. They know the full picture of what's happening. Um, that child also sp generally spends less time in the system. They are getting the services they need. They're not you know, getting stuck. They um, ultimately are getting to a place where they're going to be in a safe home that they are going to be in, hopefully permanently. You know, They're not going to be bounced around home to home. Um, they're going to spend less time in foster care if they're in foster care. Um, and that those volunteers are there to make sure that at the end of the day that child is where they need to be, whether it's back with their family, whether they end up getting adopted, whether you know they stay with in what we call a kinship placement, um, that they are in a good and safe home where they have the opportunity to thrive. The biggest one is just making sure that they don't get lost in the system. The biggest one is providing that voice for a child and being there ultimately for that kid. Um, you know, that we're not involved in whatever else is going on around. We're, we are fact finding to figure out what's going on and coming back to the court and saying this is what you know we, we recommend needs to happen. Um, and then the other big piece is getting those services. and. Um, this is kind of where the United Way piece comes in, that we are there, we're making recommendations to the court, but a lot of the places that our children and the families that we serve are going to get those services are other United Way agencies. And so they are there to support the, the overall you know, needs of that family to do better, to get to the next step, to make changes and ultimately break that cycle of abuse. So right now, there are over 800 kids in Knox County um, foster care that are that have been abused, neglected. There's more in kinship placements. We serve a variety of both of them. Um, and this past year, CASA served 244 children. So while we're obviously not serving everyone who's in care, um, we don't have the capacity to make that happen. We are making a big difference in these children's lives. And if we weren't there, then there would just be less information for the court to be able to make informed decisions about what children need, the placements they should be in and you know what ultimately is going to help them move forward in their lives.